Was this that the gateway to the desert has opened its doors to the future? The city, famous for its film history, now houses the Nur solar plant, the largest in the world, a project that aims to provide Morocco with clean, sustainable energy. Nur 1 in Wazazat is the first phase of the four Nur power plants which aim to produce clean energy in a country that imports more than 94% of its energy needs. In Nur 1 there are half a million mirrors extending across 450 hectares, producing 160 megawatts of electricity. These mirrors help to reflect sunlight to a central tube which warms a heat transfer fluid. This liquid is then transported to the power island where it turns water into steam. The steam drives a turbine producing electricity which is sent to the national grid. The plant boasts a thermal storage system with a three-hour storage capacity. The station has been operating since February 2016. It represented a formidable challenge for Moroccan engineers in terms of using new technologies and purchasing heavy equipment from around the world. Over 30% of the project was carried out by local companies in line with international standards. This is a great source of pride for us. Phases 2 and 3 of the NOAA project are under construction. It's expected they'll produce 200 and 150 megawatts of power respectively, and both will have an eight-hour storage capacity by 2017. The NOAA 2 project uses the same technology as NOAA 1, parabolic mirrors, but larger ones that will be more efficient over the same surface area. NOAA 3 will employ tower technology. The tower you see behind us will be the tallest building in Africa, standing at 243 metres high. The solar complex has contributed to developing the region's infrastructure and is helping to alleviate unemployment in Wazazat by creating nearly 2,000 jobs during the construction of each phase. 35-year-old Azadine started work as a driver two years ago. I'm like all those lucky young people who got the opportunity to get a real job. I feel more stable with a fixed salary every month. Before, we were dependent on the cinema industry or tourism, which are temporary. Now, thank God that people in the city have the opportunity to work and benefit from this project. Projects like NOR will help support Morocco's aim of sustainable development and its goal of generating 42% of its energy from renewables by 2020.